Yo, what's good, what's good? So, everyone was um, commenting on the video saying that, you know, Deji and KSI, they met up. They, they met each other at the house. Oh, my gosh. Yes. A crying moment. Yes. Oh, Lord. They finally, finally, as brothers, met each other. Oh, my God. Yes. All this happened before. During the Christmas beef, KSI went over laughing Deji laughing at everything you know what I'm saying like like low key Deji is just I don't know man Deji is just <laughs> the man is a man child bro like come on man the, the dude acts like a kid sometimes he really do but look listen I'm not hating I'm actually I'm glad that they met up I'm glad that they made up you know not made up or met I'm actually I'm all, I'm all messed up in the face but um I'm glad that they met they made up, they talked, you know, and uh, KSI gave him some pointers. Look, you can't cheat boxing. But the thing is, with everything KSI is telling him, Deji is 24 years old. You mean to tell me Deji could not have thought of this on his own? Like, I'm pretty sure he had people in his comment section telling him this. Deji, if you don't train, you will get beasted. If you do train, you will wax your opponent. KSI has said this many times, especially with Jake. He told him, your potential is way higher than mine. Vidal said this. Deji is natural to boxing. When he was young, he was doing all these other skill sets. He was fast, all that stuff. We all seen it with our own eyes in videos that they posted. Deji always had the potential. But he never unleashed it, never unlocked it, never did any hard work to actually get it to be max to you know to maximize his potential to whatever that he does. I mean, like let's be honest, if KSI wasn't you know the focal point of Deji doing of of YouTube, would Deji even be a YouTuber? I mean, like 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 let's keep it a hundred right now. You know what I'm saying, like. Would Deji be a YouTuber if KSI was ever in the picture? I mean, maybe because of his friends, but would he have, you know, have someone like his brother to boost him to get there? I don't know. I, I mean, we, we all talk about how Deji got to 10 million on his own. I get that. But would he even have a YouTube channel if it wasn't for his brother? That's a conversation no one ever wants to talk about. Because we're calling, we're saying that he can't do anything for himself. Low key, the the, 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 the dude kind of can't. I mean, I mean, like anything that his brother does, he's low key kind of doing it too. Deji didn't do no fighting until it came to his brother with Jake. KSI was supposed to fight. Was supposed to fight Jake, but because Jake was the younger brother of Logan Paul, they did this big brother versus little brother thing Deji lost KSI drew a draw and then after that beat him in the second in the second fight so like I mean like I, I don't know bro I don't know I'm thinking with all of that would, K, would Deji even have a YouTube channel if it wasn't for De if it wasn't for KSI I, I don't know for me I don't know I don't know man so with all that stuff going on it's just like you know it's like Deji already knows all this stuff. He said, you know, he 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 wasn't sour. He looked like he was just laughing, but that's what he always does. He always laughs, you know. I mean, I really hope that he takes this advice seriously. I kind of do. I really hope he does. I mean, you know, for me, I was saying Deji's in a relationship right now. You know what I'm saying? He got his. He Loki has his life together. He has a girlfriend right now, Dunya. I said Dunya's low-key a part of this because, you know, two years that this man has been saying he's ready to fight, but hasn't trained. Or he said he's claimed to be training, but he hasn't trained. And then he said, like, like, like I thought, like everyone thought, as soon as we saw his body type, he was saying that, you know, 
the plan was to knock him out in the first round. What, what? Huh? What? What plan is that? So after the first round, what, 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 what are you going to do? <laughs> you never thought of what if it doesn't go like that? What if that doesn't happen? You don't think, you don't, you like, you did not think of that as like a, a plan B? What if he doesn't? What if I don't knock him out in the first round? What, like, I don't, I don't understand. Like, that's not how every fight goes. Where you try to knock, I mean, obviously you're going to try to. But it ain't guaranteed that you knock your opponent in the first round. This isn't a straight fight. This man is trained to bob and weave, duck and dive every punch to knock your goofy ass out. Like, this ain't a street fight. This ain't just, oh, get your hands up, let's get it, let's get ready. Nah, this is weeks of training, months of training, preparation to beat you in a ring in front of thousands of people in, a, in, a, in an arena and online. So, like, like, nah, this ain't a street fight. This is boxing. I mean, I, I mean, DDG, he, he he street fought that boy Nate. I mean, you can't say there was barely any class in that fight. Nate didn't even know what the hell he was doing. He like that man looked skinny as hell. I, I, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Cause I'm no boxing expert, but bro, I've seen enough to talk about it. Okay, like I, I've seen enough to talk about it. Legends like Canelo, Floyd. You know what I'm saying? They all look, you know chiseled, muscular for any fight. You know what I'm saying? Like, for any fight, they look chiseled. For any fight, they're ready. You know how big Logan Paul was? And Floyd, like, he, Logan Paul couldn't even knock out Floyd? Experience, man. So if Logan Paul, that size, that huge, couldn't knock out little Floyd, a 40-plus-year-old man in a ring... Deji, what the hell was you going to do against an 18-year-old that's way more agile, way more younger than you, has more mortality over you because he's younger? Like, the man didn't even develop yet. Like KSI said, you lost to an anime character. So, I, like, I don't, I, don't, I don't get what... Man. Like I said, disappointed you lost the fight. Glad that you letting your brother talk to you, give you advice, you know, all that stuff. But at the end of the day, KSI can't always hold your hand, dog. He like he can't. The man got his career going too right now. Like you're 24 years old, man. 24. Like you actually have the choice to run your own life. Your brother's there as a big brother. Big brother protects little brothers. That is the role of big brothers. I'm a big brother myself. You protect your little brother. But at the end of the day, if your little brother not taking big brother's advice, you got to let him get bit a couple times until he finally learns his lesson. And for me, I'm hoping that that he finally learned his lesson with his loss this absolute terrible loss to Vinny Hacker. But, you know, hopefully he takes his brother's advice and keeps it pushing. Gets better. Gets ripped. Does what he needs to do. Stay off social media for a while. You can do a hiatus too. You don't have to upload. Nigga, you got more money than anyone out, anyone right now. Well, not more than anyone, but you got enough to not even do YouTube for a good minute. You have enough. Like, you don't have to do YouTube. YouTube is a hobby. Yeah, I get that, but there is something called a break. You take a break. You take a vacation day. You work on yourself. You get your mind right before you go back to what you like to do. Every artist, every everybody out there, they, you know, after they're done working hard, if they got brand new ideas, they keep going until like, you know, they need they need a break. They need to calm the mind down, get get the mind right, and come back ten times better than they did before. You can do the same thing too, man. You know, 
Like I said, man, I'm not hating on Deji. I love Deji. The dude, the dude is funny. I, I've watched him for years. I've watched him since, what, 2015, I can say? The last, like, the first video I watched on him was a, was a Tekken tag, uh, tag Team Tournament 2 with his brother, KSI. That was the last, that was the first video I saw of him. I think that was 2015. I don't know. I don't know when that was. But it was a while ago. I watched. Like, I, I've been watching the dude for a minute. So it, it, it's kind of sad to see, like, you know, you're going through all this and no one's going to talk to you about it. I mean, besides your brother. But I don't know, man. But look, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, you do what you got to do. Get your mind right, man. Get your mind right. You won't be able to succeed. You won't be able to get past your ambitions. You won't be able to get past your demons until your mind is right, man. You won't be able to get past anything. Until you're truly yourself, man. That's how it is. You know? It's kind of a shame people are already giving up on you, saying that don't box anymore. But that's kind of like, that's kind of shameful because like you really lost to someone you should have never, ever lost to. No disrespect to Vinny, but Vinny, like, you should have got beat, bro. That's the case. You should have got waxed. But regardless of the fact, regardless of the matter, you know what I'm saying? Deji, do better, man. Do better. Get your mind right.